But if only you could see them, you would know from their faces there were kings and queens, followed by princes and princesses. There were future power people throwing love to the loveless, shining a light because they wanted it seen. Morning Panthers, Mr. Celepina here on Monday, April 27th, bringing you your morning announcements. Now, I know some of you may be sitting there saying, wait a minute, where's Mr. Hazler this morning? And trust me, I love watching his inspirational videos as much as you do, but I'm also grateful for the opportunity to come into your living room this morning and give some words of wisdom. Let me start by saying how unbelievably proud I am of each and every one of you for not only sticking to this plan but excelling during this school closure. Uh, this is not an easy time for anybody and it's important that we find the good in every single day and possibly make those deep connections and memories with our families while we're at home each and every day. I'd like to make an athletic reference and I believe we are in the fourth quarter with this and we have to keep fighting the good fight so we do not go into overtime. So please stay home, keep washing your hands, do everything that you've been doing. You're doing great so far. We're all proud of you. Keep up the hard work and remember, tough times don't last, tough people do. Have a great day, Panthers. Hey Panthers, it's Mr. Portis. Hope everybody's having a good, or had a good weekend. I'm here with my dog, Brady. You can guess how he got his name. Um, we had an awesomely soggy weekend and once again, a very disappointing draft from the Patriots. But anyway, um, as we look forward to getting ready for May, I want to wish everybody the best of luck with staying strong throughout these very challenging times. Um, my dog had different ideas about how this video was going to unfold. Well, I really want to thank everyone for your tremendous strength as a school community. Uh, these certainly have not been easy times, but instead of complaining about things, we've instead found ways to create new opportunities for ourselves and for each other. Uh, your dedication to the community has not gone unnoticed. Uh, we met with Chilton on Friday and they voiced their appreciation for everything they've seen from our school community as well as our greater community. And I think that really reflects the, the people that we are and the people we're gonna continue to be as these last two months of school unfold. I can't say I know what they're gonna look like, but I know that we're gonna make the best of it. And whatever opportunities we have to support one another, we're gonna continue to step up because that's what we do. Uh, I want you to have a great week this week uh, as we show our love for animals throughout this week. Um, stay strong, Panthers. We're going to keep working on things together. Keep being yourselves and uh, have a great week. Thanks. Hey, happy Monday, Panthers. Hope everybody had a great weekend. Special shout out to Mr. Silipina and Mr. Portis for today's inspiring messages. You know, every day we're going to have a surprise guest or guests. And I want to thank Mr. Silipina and Mr. Portis for their leadership during this time. You know, when you think about a leader, a leader knows the way, shows the way, goes the way, and most importantly, grows each day. And Mr. Silipina and Mr. Portis continue to inspire us with their leadership and their desire to grow as educators and leaders. And they're just two tremendous people. And we're very fortunate to have them leading the way during this difficult time. This week, we're going to be highlighting our student activities and all of our student leaders. So today we're going to be highlighting our future business leaders of America and our HOSA groups. Very, very happy with everything that they've been doing this year and how hard they've been working. You know, our FBLA continues to compete. They're competing at the state level right now uh, and this week. Uh, so just tremendous job by that group and Mr. Honig is the advisor. And our HOSA group under the direction of Mrs. Valverde, uh, they've been involved in a lot of competitions and conferences. They are our future health professionals group. And again, they are truly dedicated and Definitely needed at this time. You know, they're, they're, they met with Chilton on Friday and uh, just heard a lot about what the nurses and doctors are doing over there. So shout outs to those two groups today. And lastly, in terms of morning announcements, we don't have too many this week. Today's Love of Animals, uh, this week is Love of Animals Week. And so hopefully throughout the week, you can send me a picture of your pet or you with a favorite stuffed animal as we recognize and celebrate animals this week. And that, that came from our elementary school. So shout out to our elementary students. And lastly, I'm going to be having some meetings. We have meetings today with our, our senior executive officers and uh, look forward to talking about some senior activities. So other than that, Panthers, just stay hydrated. Keep those claws sharp. Keep working in your classrooms and keep inspiring me every single day. I'm so proud of you guys. So have a great day, Panthers. Take care. When your love